Welcome to Wolfenstein The Old Blood. This came out just a little bit after The New Order, the first game in the sort of Wolfenstein revival series. Although it came out after, it's actually a prequel to The New Order. And unlike the first game, where I'd watched a full playthrough of it before playing it myself, this one I haven't seen anything of at all, so I'm going into this completely fresh. Also, The Old Blood seems to be a lot less liked than The New Order, so I wonder why. I guess we'll probably find out. I'm not expecting a huge amount from it, I'm expecting it to be probably more of the same, maybe a little samey to the New Order, but I mean, the New Order was very, very good and very fun, so even if it is just kind of more of the same, I think I'll still enjoy it quite a bit. I also love how the text here, the old blood, is stylized like a, a B-horror movie. See the same difficulty as before, Death Incarnate, the, I guess, high difficulty? This war is a disease. Pass through blood spilled by warriors. I feel the winds from the gathering storm. In Hauptquartier des Führers sprach der Oberkommandierende des Heeres am 15. März 1946 über die jüngsten Erfolge der deutschen Armee. Voller Zuversicht, dass der Endsieg in nur wenigen Jahren zu erreichen sei, sprach er dem großen Fortschritt der deutschen Waffentechnologie unter der Führung von General Wilhelm Strasse einen großen Anteil an... I hope you don't mind the weight of the world on your shoulders, Agent Blaskowitz. I've got pretty solid shoulders, Agent One. Well, we're losing the bloody war. Nobody told me. HQ's put a tight lid on it. General Death said is manufacturing unstoppable killing machines in a secret compound. One of his lieutenants, Helga von Schabs, is keeping the folder mentioned in your mission briefing at her base of operations, Castle Wolfenstein. This folder contains the location of Death Head's compound. Hold on a second. Look at the keychain hanging off of the key. That's um Oh, I recognize it. What is it? It's it's like a rocket launcher or a shotgun from, I don't know, Quake or something? It could be our last chance, this. Before the Nazis wipe out all that's good in the world. America would never fold. <laughs> all right, here's the checkpoint. Remember your cover. Commander Franz, Nazi bastard from the SS in Frankfurt. Die Papiere, bitte. Hier. Fahren Sie zum Kontrollpunkt da vorne und zeigen Sie dort Ihre Papiere. Vielen Dank. Wiedersehen. You and me, Blaskowitz. What a good team. We can do this. Okay, look. You're German? Frankly, it's atrocious. <laughs> so no talking. And keep your gun holstered for as long as you can. The papers Kessler prepared for you are in the glove box. There. Okay. Let's go. And remember, stay focused, stay quiet, and follow me, right? Commandant Franz, Aus Frankfurt, Guten Morgen, Guten Morgen. Fuck it. <laughs> Um Himmels Willen stramm stehen, Fritz. Herr Jäger kommt gleich. Jawohl. Er macht Hundefutter aus dir, wenn er dich so sieht. Was soll ich denn dann deiner Mutter erzählen? Entschuldige, Onkel. Nenn mich nicht so. Entschuldigung. <laughs> Think of what just happened from the perspective of the commander behind me. You're a commander, walking down the stairs. You see a stranger in front of you. Rip an entire map off of the wall and shove it into their pocket. Not suspicious at all. Zeigen Sie Ihre Papiere. 
Hier, bitte sehr. Hm. Alles klar. What do I feel like I'm gonna be pushing this person off of here to their death? Oh yeah, I'm so gonna push them, aren't I? It really feels like it. Stuff's about to go wrong. Guten Morgen, Herr Jäger. Wait a minute. Is that? Was gibt's, Greta? Die Papiere, bitte. I can't remember if that's the person that was in the New Order, but remember the person in the New Order who was taking care of uh, Max? And they were, they used to be a Nazi and changed sides. So that could be them. I just, I'm not entirely sure. Augenblick, warten Sie. Aus Frankfurt. Sind Sie Frankfurter? Ja, äh, ein Hot Dog. Das war ein komischer Kreis. Die Spinnen, die Amis. Yeah, this person knows I'm a fake. Die wird sich wundern, wenn wir an der Macht sind. Weiter. Kreta, bei Fuß. Oh, they're playing with expectations. That was totally that scene where everybody's laughing. <laughs> oh, good joke, and you know that it's just about to turn to, no, I know you're actually a fake, but then it didn't. Subverting my expectations. I like it. Hot dog. Reckon I had to say something. That was Rudy Jaeger, Helga's second in command. I hear he feeds his dogs with prisoners from the castle's dungeon. Oh yeah, so I never read any of these notes. Or, I think, either none of them or almost none of them in The New Order. Because I'd already seen it played through and I just didn't really feel like it. But I might actually do it now. Um, let's see, I'll just start reading them and we'll see how it goes. Article, Castle Wolfenstein, Assassin Executed. Berlin, 3rd of January, 1946. It was the Fuhrer himself who put the noose around the neck of the assassin known as the Castle Wolfenstein Terrorist when he was executed early Sunday morning. Herr Hitler was in a fine mood, having recovered remarkably well from the cowardly assassination attempt. As he was led into the execution chamber, the terrorist soiled himself when he saw our Fuhrer in such good health. Let this be a powerful reminder that all enemies of our great nation will meet a righteous end, said her Hitler, after the assassin had stopped twitching where he hung from the rope. When asked about the status of his well-being, he answered with strength and conviction. It is time to quell the insidious rumors claiming that I was badly hurt by the terrorist and that he managed to escape. They were fabrications manufactured by our enemies. Everyone who is found to repeat those lies will face trials, will face trial as traitors of the Reich. Okay, so what I'm getting from this is that Hitler was actually badly hurt, and this is just a piece of propaganda, trying to make it sound like Hitler's in infallible, can't be hurt. Guten Morgen. Morgen. It's going remarkably well so far. Von Schaps. What a nasty piece of work. Handpicked by Death's Head himself as a key member of the SS Paranormal Division. Paranormal Division? Is this game going to include the paranormal? Now, I had the misfortune of encountering her on a mission to Tanzania. Did I ever tell you about that, Blaskowitz? was sick with Blackwater fever at the time. Possibly the worst day of my life. Not even a heavy diet of whiskey could improve my condition, if you can imagine. Ah, anyway, this castle, Helga owns it. It's her occult research center. Now we need to take down Death's Head or the war will be lost. And Helga is vital in doing this. 
There's a top secret document folder in Helga's office. It should give us the location of Death's Head's compound. Once we have that, well then, we can launch an assault on his base of operations. Shoot him dead, turn this failure of a war around, and be back just in time for tea. Something that I'm kind of worried about is with this, there's a little bit of the tension lost in this whole plan of trying to stop Death's Head and going after Helga. I mean, I don't, maybe we do kill Helga. I'm not sure, but obviously we don't kill Death's Head because they were alive in the future in the New Order. So we know that whatever we do here is not going to stop Nazi Germany from winning the war. So it removes a little bit of the tension, but hopefully there'll be something else interesting to kind of take its place. Right. Off you go. I'll disable the alarm. You head for Helga's research center. We'll stay in touch via radio, leaving the channel open. Going into this dark research center for the paranormal. I'm getting like horror movie vibes. Between the look of this place and what it's for, and the fact that the old blood font up here looks like a horror movie, is this going to be sort of a, a horrorish bent to it? If so, that could be very cool. Okay, I still seem limited in what I can do. I, I can't select any weapon or anything like that. So I think I'm still in the prologue, basically. Ich danke Ihnen. Äh, darf ich fragen, ob Sie etwas gefunden haben? Ende. Es ist schon eine Weile her, seit mich eine Expedition so fasziniert hat. Laut unseren Messungen ist der Boden unter uns hohl. Und in den Kirchenruinen muss es eine Art Höhle oder... Oh, I fucking love this. Paranormal Research Center. And Helga's talking about there being some sort of hollow place beneath us, an expedition, weird readings, uh, beneath a church. This is totally going to be horror. Needs a cigarette after that phone call. Oh, am I supposed to give you something? Oh, no. <laughs> I just took the map from their desk right in front of them. Okay, yeah, stealth. Good job, Blaskowitz. Und jetzt hältst du den Mund. Verstanden? 
Hast du mich verstanden? Du hast gesagt, ich soll den Mund halten. <laughs> Smart ass. So I wonder if the old blood is, I don't know, vampires or something? God, I hope so. Okay, inside the elevator. Let's try to remain stealthy. Don't have a throwable knife yet. What the hell is it that they have on their back? Wait, mouse one. Oh, hold on. Sorry, I messed up a keybind. There we go. Assault rifle. A new gun. Yes, we got new guns. A German army service rifle with a fire selector for switching between automatic and burst fire mode. Useful when taking on several enemies at once at medium range. Full auto and burst. I'm going to go with full auto and I can just burst myself if I want to. This thing's big and chunky. Up on the catwalk, BJ. Don't shoot. It's just me. so cool. Look at all the creepy stuff they've gotten from the expedition. If I was a safe, where would I hide? Well, I guess I wouldn't hide because I wouldn't be sentient, would I? But I guess I would just <laughs> be. So, where would I be then? That is so cool. Blasco, let's go through every nook and cranny. We're not leaving here without that folder. I'm, I'm super into this so far. I was barely paying attention to what they were saying. Just looking at all this cool stuff. Okay, so that's Helga. Um, that shotgun, I think that's the same one we had at one point in the New Order, right? Pretty sure? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, so they're not all new weapons. Of course, this is the same. These are new. Shh. Nice Skyrim helmet that I can use as armor. Note from Research Assistant Lang, 4th of January, 1945. Helga's in a meeting with the fear of the whole week. Got to shake his hand. Seemed like a very pleasant man, but his hands were clammy and cold. There was a faint unpleasant odor, too. Helga assigned me to lead the research team while she was preoccupied with our visitor. Discoveries of note. An ancient construction sketch. Lodged in between two wooden panels. Seemed to have been used during the building of this castle. The castle was commissioned by King Otto to be grandiose, impressive, terrifying to his enemies. Must have been quite the sight back then. A marvelous technical achievement by any standards. What piqued my interest was when I looked at the sketches and saw several spaces I could find no entrance to. Maybe some kind of hidden opening device? We'll report this to Helga immediately, when she's not otherwise engaged. Could it be the lost treasures of King Otto? Secrets. Pathfinder calling Landseer. Come in, Landseer. Over. This is Landseer speaking. Over. Landseer, we can't find Lucy's present. Over. Pathfinder, I have new 
information regarding Lucy's present. Rendezvous with me as soon as you can. We will discuss further. Over. Roger. Pathfinder out. Shit! Bloody hell! Hold him off, Blaskowitz! I'll find us an escape route! Remember! Nothing good left in the world! Shoot those Nazis, Blaskowitz! No problem. Get on it! Holy crap, there's so many supplies in here. <laughs> oh crap, I'm doing bad on health. I'm doing very bad. Wow, they really use those grenades more this time, huh? Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, nice. And we still have a chance. Kessler knows something. Ooh. Recognize that orb thing? I think we found something like that inside of the dot you should vault of magical technology under the sea. Meeting Kessler in the village tavern. Roger that. Here we are. Get up here as quick as you can. Uh, yeah, give me a minute. I need stuff. Helga's Diary, Entry 1. 6th of January, 1945. Leg has kept me up the last couple of nights. Terrible itching. Fortunate side effect. Time to think and study. I think I understand more about who my ancestor King Otto was. His ambitions and dreams. The righteous fire that burnt within him. Almost, I would dare say, divine in nature. He was destined to be the Holy Roman Emperor. What is my destiny? Or, rephrase, can my destiny be controlled? Yesterday we found King Otto's secret study chamber, thanks to my research assistant. Valuable things hidden inside. Research papers, alchemical texts, maps. Reminded, briefly, painfully, of when I found my father hanging from the ceiling in his study at the old estate. How cold its great walls seemed after, as if it died with him. Should not dwell on these things. Concentrate on the research. We'll go for refreshments, despite the late hour. Oh, and I found Helga's letter. It's weird that, like, these letters, I guess because they're technically collectibles, they don't appear as a normal, just read it right there kind of entry. You gotta go into a menu. Hmm. 
This is a surprising amount of text. I don't know. It feels too text heavy if I read everything, but I'll keep going for now. Uh, my dear Reinhold, I have a secret to share, a secret concerning ancient kings and arcane knowledge. But first, you know how to write a letter that warms a woman's heart, my dear Reynold? And thank you so much for the wine. It was delicious. I hope you know how much I enjoy and value our continued correspondence, even though we are no longer lovers. Perhaps it was for the best, our separation, because I have witnessed sides of you now that I had never seen during any of our years before. Perhaps you were unable to open up your heart to women that you are romantically involved with. Anyway, I'm currently drowning in work, and it seems I will be so for most of this year. I feel like an absolute bore, but I must decline your invitation to visit your estate in Florence. As soon as my calendar clears up, I will contact you, I promise. About the secret. Big things are afoot here at Castle Wolfenstein. Do you remember I confided in the last letter I sent you about finding King Otto's secret study chamber here in the castle? Well, I found the king's very own diary. I've had it translated, and my god, Reynold... It is such a fascinating read. I knew a lot about King Otto before, of course, seeing that I am a direct descendant to him, but I did not know that he had such a fervent interest in the occult sciences. Like me. It seems to run in the family. This fascination seems to have developed after the death of his wife, Edgith. It must have been a great loss to him. Of course, these personal details mean little to me, but what intrigued me, dear Reynold, is what the king wrote about some parchments which came into his possession during an incident in Istanbul. These parchments seem to have been mostly related to advanced alchemical research. Even more fascinating, the king began to create war, uh, create war machines, which he used to expand his empire. You can understand this sparked my curiosity. That's why I decided to start an investigation into what treasures of his could still be buried in this part of the country. I have recently launched an expedition to the nearby city of Wolfburg, and I am currently making preparations to go there myself and oversee the operation. Anyway, hope to see you soon. Love, Helga. Okay, this... Ah, I'm sorry, it's too much. BJ, keep moving. Shit. Is this going to be like Escape from Butcher Bay? Feels a little bit reminiscent of it. That's another game by Machine Games, by the way. What are those? Yep, I'm here, Wesley. Good, good. I'll get us out of here somehow. You ever been to Snowdonia, Blaskovitz? No, never been. It's a majestic and beautifully desolate place. Rolling hills as far as the eye can see. My father used to take me hiking there sometimes, before the Great War. He was happy back then. He'd pack a basket full of bread and cheddar. Bottle of ale for him and a soft drink for me. Ew. Even found a fossil there once. The same day I broke my foot slipping on a wet stone. That was the best day of my life. We Sorry to interrupt you, but I do want to read this one. Lottie's letter. Whoever reads this, my name is Lottie Cole. I was imprisoned here by Helga. Please, 
Contact my father in Wolfburg. Name is Robert Cole. Works at the library. Tell him Helga is investigating the defiled church. Please, this is very urgent. Tell him I love him. That note is covered in a lot of blood. Had a chance to go back there. Evening, officer. Mm. What do you Good luck, Wesley. I mean, that was obviously going to happen. That part of the pipe was so much brighter than everything else. Weapon? New weapon pipes. Oh, this reminds me of Escape from Butcher Bay so much. We gotta start out with melee weapons for a while. The pipes are useful for climbing special walls, opening hatches, and to break unsteady walls and wooden crates. Pipes are also useful when engaging an enemy at melee range or when sneaking up on an enemy from behind to perform a takedown. Interesting. So this is sort of like the version of that laser thing that you get in the new the new order. Sort of, in the sense that it's a bit of a utility thing that could be used to open places that you otherwise couldn't get to. Neat. So right click is a very quick double attack. Left click is a big swing. Alternate mouse one and two to climb. Oh, you gotta hold them down, otherwise you actually let go. Interesting, okay. Oh, this feels good. Super soldiers leashed up by those cables. Turn it off the power, maybe shuts them down. Okay, well, I think that's a pretty good place to end this episode. Yeah, so far I'm super into this. I'm very intrigued by the promises of spooky occult stuff to come. I hope we actually get to see that. I feel like we probably will, so I'm very hopeful. But so far I'm into this. So that has been... I was about to say, that has been Wolfenstein the Old Blood, as if we just reached the end of it. No? <laughs> Still got a bit more to go. Anyway, I uh, hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.